I'm gonna show you how to install the Tuniverse Texture Pack for Minecraft 1.21 in this video. Let's go ahead and get started. To install the Tuniverse Texture Pack, it's extremely simple. Click on that second link in the description that is going to bring you to their Curse Works page where we could download the most recent version of the Texture Pack. As you can see, the first one right here is 1.21. If you can see it in there, just make sure you scroll down until you find it. Click on these three dots right next to it and click download file. And within five seconds, the download for Tuniverse Texture Pack will begin. Just go ahead and wait for it. And while the Texture Pack is downloading, if you need a Minecraft server, go ahead and head over to that first link in the description where you could get 25% off any server you create in here. It could be a server with over 200 mod packs. It could be a Java or a Bedrock server, a server that is hosted online 24 seven. So you don't have to worry about IP leaks, IP attacks, or having your computer on all the time or anything like that, because this is completely hosted by Apex Hosting. Something that I personally love besides them having locations all around the world. So you don't have to worry about lagging is that you could actually control, create and access the server console through your phone, meaning that you could be away from the house and still kick people out of your server, change the settings of your server, whatever you want to do through the phone, because it is your server. I'm going to leave that first link in the description and now let's keep going with the tutorial. Now, once Tuniverse Texture Packs download, let's go ahead and drag and drop it into our desktop. You should find it here in your recent download history. Go ahead and drag and drop it into your desktop. And now go ahead and open your Minecraft launcher. Now with the Minecraft launcher open, go ahead and launch Minecraft. I'm actually going to use the Iris and Sodium version, which allows you to add shaders because using Texture Packs is way better when you have shaders. However, if you have the normal Minecraft, that will also work. Let's go ahead and hit play. And if you want to learn how to install Iris so you can use shaders, go ahead and subscribe to the channel because we have a ton of videos on that. And also we have a bunch of guides in our website. Now, once the game loads, just go ahead and launch a single player or a multiplayer world. You could also add the texture packs through the menu, but I mean, I'd rather do it while I'm in a world so I could actually see the before and after. And remember, if you need a multiplayer world, go ahead and use that first link in the description for 25% off with Apex Hosting. As you can see, I already have some shaders in here. And as you can see, I also have some texture packs. These are called the bare bones texture packs, and we have videos on how to install it. If you want to learn that, go ahead and watch that next. Anyways, let's go ahead and add the Tuniverse texture pack. Go ahead and press escape, head over to options, Head over to resource packs in here and in here you most likely won't have all these texture packs that i have i have a bunch of them let's go ahead and actually take the bare bones texture pack off so minecraft could go back to normal which is probably what your minecraft is going to look like right your minecraft looks like this so again head over to escape options resource packs and in here we're going to click where it says open pack folder that is going to open a folder that most likely will be empty for a bunch of you guys all you have to do now is drag and drop that zip file that we downloaded in the first step the tuniverse zip file into this folder so go ahead and drag and drop it into here close out from this big folder you could even delete the tuniverse zip file from the desktop head back into minecraft and now scroll down in here until you see the tuniverse as you can see mine just got added in here hit on this little arrow in there that'll bring it over here and now hit done and give it a second for it to load as you can see it's giving me a little error up here saying that it is not compatible with sodium we should be fine though King, as you can see obviously this texture pack works way better with optifine if you want to have the sky with the cool sun and everything looking amazing you have to install optifine unfortunately optifine 1.21 has come out yet but of course as soon as it comes out we're gonna have a video on the channel we're gonna have videos on the channel for everything that you need to know but this is pretty much how to install the tuniverse texture pack if this video helped you out don't forget to subscribe that's all i ask in return and as always bye bye